Rachel from Parenting Central and today I'm going to talk to you about the latest pram from Baby B Prams. It is the Baby B Prams Comet Plus. It is an upgraded version of the original Comet and it has some really great new features. So it has a huge extendable hood that zips out and comes out even further. It has these really lovely leatherette features. Um, it has a plush uh, liner both on the seat and inside the bassinet. It comes with airfield tires as standard and also the main seat has been weight tested up to 20 kilos so you're going to get a lot of years out of this pram. Some of the features have stayed the same though between the Comet Plus and the Comet. It weighs 10 kilos with the main seat or 10.5 with the bassinet. It has an adjustable handlebar, it goes up to 101 centimetres high, which is quite tall. I'm 163 centimetres tall and I find the middle setting is right for me. Uh, it has a really easy to use foot brake. The basket's quite accessible even with the bassinet on, you can still get a bag in and out of that space. Otherwise, it's just a really easy pram to use, it's easy to fold, um, and it doesn't take up too much room for the boot, which is great as well. One of the things that I love about this pram is that you do get the bassinet included in the price. So you get the fabric for both the bassinet and the main seat and they come with the same um, bar that you attach them to. So when you finish with your bassinet, you just remove the fabric and then you replace it with the main seat um, at around six months old or when your baby starts to sit up. You also get all the accessories included. So you get this really awesome travel organizer, you get the foot mark, you get the bumper bar, you get the rain cover and the mosquito net. The only thing is it doesn't come with a tire pump. So if you don't have a bike pump laying around, you will need to purchase one separately for the airfield tires. One other really cool thing about this pram is there are actually pockets on the bassinet. I don't think I've ever seen pockets on a bassinet before. So you've got some pockets here. I guess you can pop not much, but maybe a dummy or... Um, a couple of bits and pieces into those little pockets at the front. There's also a really great pocket on the back of the main seat, which I will show you in just a minute. So now I've got the pram set up for your older baby or your toddler. And as I said, it's got this really big pocket on the back. There is a large pocket and a skinnier pocket, so you can organize all your bits and pieces, but you can put your phone, your wallet, your keys, all that kind of stuff that you're gonna want, really easy and accessible right there. Um, with the travel organizer, you've got so many storage options on this pram. I really do love the way they've thought about the storage for this pram. Okay, now let's have a look at the seat. The seat is 30 centimeters wide and then 49 centimeters to the top of the backrest and 56 centimeters to the top of the hood. I don't know if this is officially what you should do, but this is what I did, because I tested this out with a four-year-old who was just pushing the height on it, but you know, four is a good run for a pram anyway. Um, I moved the clip for the hood just up a little bit higher above the spacer thing that's here, and I was able to fit him in no problem. So I don't know if you're officially supposed to do that, but that's just what I did to kind of extend the, the use of the pram. Also, while we're talking about the hood, I should show you just how far it comes out. So we unzip it and it comes all the way down to this. So if you do have a toddler sitting in that seat, they're not gonna be able to even see. So you're gonna use this when they're having a sleep or something like that because otherwise, I mean, that's got them completely covered. Though that's gonna be great if you've got a sudden downpour um, or really bad weather. I mean, that's gonna keep them nice and cozy without even having to get out the rain cover. So it has four recline positions. It obviously has the upright position, which is quite a nice upright seat. It's also a really good height to park it at a table, say at a cafe or a restaurant, so you don't have to take your baby or your toddler out if you're having a meal. Um, it has four positions, so it has a semi-reclined, a little bit further back, and then the, oh, I missed one, there we go. One, two, three, four. So, a slight variation slight variations all the way down. As you can see, it was a two-handed recline. I do have a preference for a one-handed recline, but that's just, you know, a personal preference. To fold the pram is really easy. There is a little button on this side and then toggles that you just pull up and drop it down like that. So you can fold it obviously with the seat attached, but it's a little bit more compact if we do actually remove the seat and just pop that on. And then if you take off the bumper bar as well, that's gonna fit into most boots. It fit easily into the boot of my Holden Astra. So to open it back up, you just have to um, release the automatic lock, lift up the handlebar, give it a flick, and then just pop your 
seat back on. And wait for that little click. Done. I did take the pram for a spin, fully loaded with a four-year-old, and we went across grass and playground mulch, and also it had been raining, so the ground was a little bit soft and muddy. And these rear big wheels actually handled everything really great. My only thing that I'd like to point out is that the front wheels are actually still a little bit on the small side, so they did catch a couple of times on some bumps and I'll attach a video to sort of show how it handled across those surfaces and you will see the moment where I did catch on the edge of the playground um, barrier. Uh, but it's with the wheels, it does have a really easy pop. So you've just got to kind of watch where you're going, I guess, to avoid it catching. So I would say this is a really great, robust city and suburban pram, but it's not really an all-terrain pram. So overall, I think that the Baby Bee Prance Comet Plus is a great pram. I love that it comes newborn ready all the way up to a toddler or a three or a four year old. It's easy to use. It comes with all the accessories. It's really good value for money. Otherwise, if you have any other questions, please let me know. I will do my best to answer them. And you know, like, subscribe, follow, all that kind of stuff for more pram reviews. Or if there are any other prams you would like me to review that I haven't reviewed already, please let me know as I'm always looking for new prams to review. Um, take care. Goodbye.